Welcome back, folks, in the blue corner. We have a fighter fighting out of Ethiopia. He fights from the ASD team, Marcedo. His coach is Jean Pietro Marcedo. He is originally from Ethiopia, but he's fighting from Italy. 27 years old, 1.8 meters tall, right handed, 36 fight, 32 victories, 6 by knockouts. Kebromi Neguzi. In the red corner, his opponent from Brazil, from Niterói, Rio de Janeiro, fighting out of the Nova Union. His coaches are Hega Zulu and Pedro Rizzo. He's 32 years old, 1.71 meters tall, right-handed. He's had 48 fights, 36 victories, 10 by knockout. Let's introduce, in the red corner, Emerson Falcão. Super Orlando, Rodriguez. Orlando Rodriguez is the referee once again, this great referee in the middle of the ring. We have Emerson, we have a good combination fighter, very experienced, good counter punching, good counter attacks. And from what we see and what we have known, this is his first fight in the WGB. Kebroni Neguzi is a good boxer and has very good kicks. Let's see where these guys are going to take us tonight. And there goes a good kick started off to start it off by King. And these guys are starting out aggressive and fast and strong right off the bat. Oh, and there goes an absolutely furious Emerson Falcão moving in with a very, very, very strong punch, very fast. And the Ethiopian able to get out of the way and just off the ropes. Oh, and there goes a good leg kick from Kibroni. These guys are very, very, very aggressive in this first round. Oh, and a good right overhand by Falcon, catching Kibroni Neguzi just on the side of the head. And now they're slowing down a little bit, feeling each other a little bit better and we see Kebroni Neguzi using that left leg roundhouse kick a good execution kick but he's holding it out there and Falcone is able to grab onto it good leg kick from Falcone Emerson Falcone from Rio de Janeiro 32 years old Kebroni Neguzi a little bit of a taller fighter a little bit thinner very strong looking Emerson Falcone a little bit shorter needs to find their distance these guys and there goes Emerson Falcone trying to move in close he's very fast very strong once he gets in but we see a very agile Kibromi Neguzi both of these guys doing a great job great technique from both of them there was a good back leg roundhouse kick from Kibroni. Good boxing skills from Kibroni as well. He's not able to catch Falcon as of yet, but he's got some fast hands. And we see Emerson Falcon just moving forward, trying to push his way like a bull in a china shop, moving, pushing forward, moving, not giving in ounce. And we see a more defensive Kibroni Neguzi using his faster. Oh, and there goes a right hand by Falcone catching Nebruzzi right off guard and knocking him back into the ropes. He seems to be okay, but he will feel that for the rest of this fight. Oh, and there goes a good left hand from Emerson Falcone. And now we see a Falcone. Very aggressive, but a good defense coming out of the corner of Kibroni Neguzi. And Emerson Falcone, sure of that punch. That gave him a lot of confidence. And we see the Kibroni Neguzi from Ethiopia smiling. Let's see if he's able to keep up that defensive position, keep away from those wild, strong, and hard punches coming from Emerson Falcone. Absolutely. That was a great fight, great first round very active both aggressive both of them doing a great job 
we can see a really good defensive position from Kibiru Ninigusa. There goes that right hand. We'll be right back, folks, with the second round. two of the super lightweight featured fight of the evening we saw a very good first round let's see how these guys behave themselves in this second round Here we see Anderson Falcon from Rio still moving forward using that aggressive posture pushing Kibroni Neguzi back into the ropes Kibroni Neguzi has worked obviously very well on his, de on his defense A switch up, step up, roundhouse kick from Kebroni, way off the mark. Emerson Falcon easily able to avoid and get out of the way. Emerson Falcon using those short leg kicks in close to pound away at the thigh of Kebroni Neguzi. Oh, and there was a good back leg roundhouse kick from Kebroni, but he still holds that leg out there, and Emerson Falcone is able to grab it onto it. There he goes again, same thing, holds it out there. Good combination from Kebroni Neguzi as he uses a left and a right counter punch from in close. There was a slip from Emerson Falcone. So far, not a whole lot of action like there was in the first round. Feeling each other out almost more now in the second round than in the first round. There goes Emerson Falcone pounding away at that leg again of Kibron Neguzi. You can hear Kibron Neguzi's coach yelling at him in Italian. Oh, and there goes a good roundhouse kick from Kibroni. That one caught Emerson Falcone on the left leg. Definitely, we can see a little bit of a red swelling on that left leg now. Emerson Falcone really trying to set up a haymaker. Almost preoccupied with it. And that is ch the chance for Kibroni Neguzi to use his better boxing skills and his better defensive techniques, his counter punching. As Emerson Falcon is making a few more mistakes. Oh, and there goes a good, there he goes with that good combination counter left and right from Kibiru Nibuzi. Not as strong punching power as Emerson Falcon, but very clean points, able to get in there. End of the second round. Now we see a little bit more of a confident Kibruni Neguzi in this second round. Let's see how they do after this if they're able to catch their second win for this third and final round. That round was definitely not nearly as active as the first round. Both fighters a little more cautious, not throwing as wild of punches, especially at Emerson Falco. We'll be right back, folks, with the third and final round. Falcone looking a little bit more tired than 
Kibroni Neguzi, but that is just what it looks like. We'll see in just a second if that's exactly what it is. And they're off. We're going to see a very aggressive Emerson Falk count. Oh, and there goes a good left hand from Kebroni Neguzi. Very strong, very fast. Good left leg roundhouse kick. Another roundhouse kick from Kebroni Neguzi to the body of Emerson Falcone. And there they go, tying each other up into the clinch. Referee Orlando Rodriguez breaking them up. There goes a good roundhouse kick from Nebrun, Kebruni Neguzi one more time. Emerson Falcone looking a little bit tired, trying to set up that haymaker. Still keeping good, good boxing stance. Strong guard, but not able to execute as well as he did in that first round, definitely. Obviously, they're both tired. But it looks like Kebroni Neguzi might be in a little bit better condition so far or in this fight. Oh, and there was a good left hook from Emerson Falcone just missing Kebroni Neguzi. And we've seen Kebron Neguzi, he's picking it up in this third round. He's using quite a bit of technique. He's moving around well. He doesn't look at all tired. Very good condition. He trained well for this fight, his first fight in the WGP here in Brasilia. And there he goes. He's still looking good. Roundhouse kick from him. Kibruni. Emerson not throwing a whole lot of technique now. His kicks, he's still throwing those. There goes a right hand from Emerson Falcone. Easily blocked. There goes still tapping away at that left leg or that right leg of Kibruni Neguzi. Not a whole lot of swelling. Goes Emerson Falcone pushing Nebruni Kibruni back into the ropes again. Oh, and there was a good right hand from Emerson Falcone. He's trying to, using everything he's got left in this fight to push him back, trying to knock him out. He wants that knockdown. He wants that knockout. He's knocked down Kibruni Neguzi once in this fight, and he wants to do it again, and he wants to make it clear that he is the winner. And there goes the bell for the third round. Both of these guys smile. Both of these guys confident that they are the winner. This was, that was a really great fight. That was the most action-packed first round we've seen in a long time here at the WGP. That was a great fight. First round, a lot of these guys really try to feel each other out, see where they are, see what they can use, what they can't use, judge a distance. This was a really great, great first action-packed first round. Be right back, folks, with us. the official decision from the judges. And you let us know what you think. We'll be right back. Once again, a split decision. The winner of this featured fight in the super lightweight division. The winner is... Kebromi Neguzi! 